Is there more to karma than ancient wisdom? What if the very laws of physics and psychology prove that your actions create a ripple effect echoing across the universe and your life? Karma is an ancient concept deeply rooted in Hinduism and Buddhism. But did you know that variations of this idea exist in nearly every culture? From ancient Greek notions of fate to the Christian proverb, you reap what you sow, the belief that actions have consequences is nearly universal. A 2018 survey by Pew Research found that over 60% of Americans believe in some form of karmic justice, even though it's not tied to Western religious traditions. Yet, the question remains, why do so many people believe in karma? What if it's more than a comforting thought? What if it's hardwired into our brains to expect consequences for our actions? Now, let's shift gears. In science, the principle of cause and effect is foundational. According to Newton's third law, for every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. Could this same law apply not only to objects, but also to human behavior? Think about it. Every decision you make triggers a sequence of events. But how does science explain the idea of karma? Enter the world of psychology. In psychology, we see a fascinating parallel to karma in behavioral conditioning. Pioneered by psychologists like B.F. Skinner, behavioral conditioning shows that behaviors followed by rewards are likely to be repeated, while those followed by punishment tend to disappear. He also said, a person does not act upon the world to the exclusion of being acted upon by the world. In a 2020 study published by the Journal of Experimental Psychology, researchers found that 89% of participants altered their behavior when consistently rewarded or punished for certain actions, highlighting how deeply cause and effect patterns influence our decisions. Think about it. When you do something good, you're often met with approval, and when you do something wrong, you face negative consequences. Over time, this creates patterns in your behavior, almost like a scientific version of karma. But here's where things get interesting. Let's dive into the just world hypothesis. This psychological theory suggests that people have a deep-seated belief that the world is inherently just, meaning good things happen to good people and bad things happen to bad people. People are motivated to believe that the world is a fair place where they get what they deserve. Melvin Lerner, psychologist, founder of the just world hypothesis. In a 2015 study published in the Journal of Personality and Social Psychology, Researchers found that 85% of participants exhibited signs of believing in a just world, where karma-like principles govern their perception of life events. Could this bias, our natural inclination to see the world as fair, be why so many of us believe in karma, even subconsciously? It's a coping mechanism, helping us make sense of the chaotic world around us. Now, let's zoom out, way out, and see how karma might work on a cosmic scale. Physics shows us that the universe operates under the laws of cause and effect, but is there something more profound going on? What if karma is tied to the butterfly effect? The butterfly effect, a concept from chaos theory, suggests that a small change in one part of a system can lead to massive consequences in another. This mirrors the idea of karma. Even the smallest action can ripple out into the universe, leading to significant outcomes. A 2019 study by MIT's Department of Physics found that even minuscule changes in initial conditions could lead to vastly different outcomes in a closed system validating the concept of the butterfly effect. Quantum physics adds another layer to this idea. In the famous double-slit experiment, scientists observed that particles behaved differently when they were being watched. Known as the observer effect, it suggests that simply observing something changes its outcome. Could this be a scientific manifestation of karma? What we observe is not nature itself, but nature exposed to our method of questioning. Werner Heisenberg, pioneer of quantum mechanics. Let's not forget about the social and ethical aspects of karma. Humans are wired for reciprocity, the need to return favors. This social construct is critical to building trust and cooperation in any society. Research from the Harvard Program on Evolutionary Dynamics shows that in societies where reciprocity is practiced, trust levels are higher, and these societies are more stable over time. But what happens when we break these rules? When individuals or societies act selfishly, they often experience a breakdown in relationships, leading to conflict. This is where karma's influence is most evident, not as a mystical force, but as a consequence of our ethical choices. Is karma real? From the laws of physics to the psychology of human behavior, we see strong parallels. Whether it's through the cause and effect dynamics of Newton's third law, or the complex interactions in the butterfly effect, karma might be more than just a spiritual belief. It could be a fundamental principle of how the universe and our minds work. Like the video, if you think karma exists, a global meta-analysis from Oxford University found that belief in karma across different cultures significantly correlates with greater life satisfaction and societal stability, suggesting that this principle, whether spiritual or scientific, has a tangible impact on our well-being. Note,
Whether you believe in karma as a spiritual law or a scientific principle, one thing is clear. Our actions have consequences. So, beware of the ripples you create in this world. If you found this video enlightening, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comments. Subscribe for more hidden life secrets and mysteries of the world. We may not respond, but we read every comment.